Big Hall makes me happy. Big Hall makes my day. I'm just a singing fisherman, hoping you will go away. Bonjour et bienvenue à Loire. Okay, that's as much French as you're getting out of me because it's been, uh, like, 20 years since I could decently speak French, so, uh, you don't want me to do a whole stream of that. It'd get real slow real quick. Anyways, uh, yeah, just, let's continue. For those who, who don't recall, last time we, we did all the stuff in Loire and you're like, okay, what was all that? Go watch my other stuff. I'm not gonna give a recap of my whole... Okay, yes, I will. Got Princess L to talk. The king got killed. And we voted for Jean, so now they're going to be moving forward and the town's going to progress. Hooray. And you're like, okay, that sounds great. What are you doing? We're going onwards. You're like, oh, a new place. Tell me about it. No. What? That, that doesn't seem like you. I'll tell you about this place in a minute. The thing is... Oh. Okay, let's try this again. You came through the toll gate? It must have been hard. I hear the King of Loire was killed and there's an uproar about it. But I, I shouldn't keep our tired traveler chatting. It's ten gems a night. Will you be staying? Yeah. The room's in the back. Rest easy. Anyway, so the reason why I'm not talking about this town at all or anything, you know, is because we're not done with Loire yet. Like, what? We, we just finished all the story stuff there. No, 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 no. See, we did, we we voted for Jean which means the town is going to progress to its next state. But you have to come to Litz, and I don't know if it's either resting in the inn or saving it, um, but the point is you have to come to Litz to progress Loire's expansion the first time. And so we're going to go and do some more stuff there. So sorry, Litz, our next story bit. We'll come back to you, but as you can see, Loire has expanded. Didn't get rid of this stupid toll gate that's no longer being manned because the king king's dead so there's no soldier there but let's look at the new and improved Loire. Eh, first avenue look at it. now isn't this looking fancy arf, arf, arf. that's what we had to do first we're gone now. okay so let's talk to people in this new and improved town i wonder what will happen to Loire. i'm excited uh, i can't read that okay then hello Hello? The castle's been opened to everyone after the king's death. They're supposed to be holding a speed-eating contest. Oh, they're not just supposed to. They are. Tools repaired. Grassman Pierre! <gasps> Matisse! Finally! You travel all over the world, right? I've got a favor to ask. I want to know if my art will be accepted by people of other towns. Can you help? Sure. What do you want me to do? Really? Take one of my paintings? Yeah, I've been trying to do that since we first came and met you. If you meet someone that likes art, please get their opinion. I can't pay you, but please make sure you get someone's opinion. I mean, I'm a someone. Can't I give you my opinion? He's like, no. I want someone's useful's opinion. <laughs> so now we have Matisse's painting. So stuff like that. We have to go and find someone to give this painting to. That'll be one of the quests. So, Pierre. I'm Pierre. I'm 18, and I love tinkering with Mich that. That sounds like, like a person, like, I mean, nowadays, the kids these days don't know. I mean, they, they don't know, like, it sounds like, like, a personal in the newspaper, like, I'm Pierre, Pierre, I'm 18, I love tinkering with machines, do you like long walks on the beach? Would you like to meet up for some romance? You want to see my invention? Sure. Invention? Sounds interesting. What I'm making now puts pictures of people on paper. Can I get you to stay still? Okay, ready? Boom! Uh, oh. I, I think I blew it. Uh, sorry about that. I'll rectify things, come back again. Another person. So, uh, we couldn't talk about him before because he was not in the first level of, uh, Loire. Because Loire was still kind of like, you know, French Revolution technology. Didn't really have electricity yet. Which is a little weird that, like, I don't know. Whatever, Neo-Tokyo, it's got like TVs and microwaves, so sure, that's how technology works. But Pierre is a reference to... Uh, Nicephor Nieps, who is the kind of the, the inventor of the camera. That's what he's inventing. Sorry, I spoiled it for you. But 
he's sort of like known as like the first founder guy of the camera. Uh, do you have anything interesting now that you've expanded? Not you. Ooh, weapon shop. Get lost if you're just looking. Light rod, silver pike, ice pick, ring mail, silver vest. Blocks poison. So I could also get a vest armor, more defense, but doesn't... Mm. If the next place has poison, I'm coming back. But for now, I'll leave it. We'll see if we find something. Because we did just get stuff. I don't have one of those. Tell me about this boom ring. No, I desire two of them. So I can show one off and keep one in my collection. Uh, I forget if we can actually do more here now. I think we have to, but... I just don't remember, like, if you have to, like, leave the town and come back, and then he gets... Okay, no, yeah, it's different. Now I'm set on fire instead of shocked. Hi, Pierre. Hi, I'm Pierre. I'm 18, and I like hurting me. Yes, I know. Yeah. Hey, did it, folks. Look at that. Hey, uh? Nothing happened. That, that means I did it. It worked. A machine that puts pictures on paper. Thanks for your help and sacrifice for making this machine. I'm going to call this machine Camera. I'll give you one for all your trouble, time and trouble. Thank you. Can I get the one that sets things on fire? I can use that. No. Bad arc. Stop it. Thank you. Now, the camera is important, not just because it helps Loir, but you actually need it for lots of stuff. Specifically, you have to take pictures of towns for the tourism board. So we can be like, Badum. In Loire, Ark took scenery photos. And now we can do that in every town, and we can share them with tourism boards around the world. And... Hey, you, I remember you scammed me into buying some flowers. I can't go home until I sell. Yeah, I, I already bought them. Nope, I'm good. <laughs> I don't need a flower. It's not as if I can eat it or anything. <laughs> Too cheap to buy one flower. I bought three flowers from you, and I only needed two. I only needed one, I think. Since Jean became mayor, Loire has progressed far. I see that. Oh, fortune teller. Eh, sure. What do you have to say? You're not a resident, but... Whatever. You're probably going to be like, go to Litz. That's your next story business. Your lucky item is a flower. Oh, I see. You're in a racket with the lady next door. Also, I have one, so... Sure. How's Bounty doing? Hopefully not so greedy. Did you hear? The king's dead. People are saying he was killed. Uh, they're saying the same thing. Okay. Ooh, fancy. Now, most importantly, is the dog still here? Hello. Why? Oh, <laughs> why a little girl and a penguin? I see you've also met the flower girl. Hey, the dog's still here. Hi, buddy. <gasps> yeah, he did his bow again. Woo! Totally worth expanding the... Oh, oh, so I picked the wrong room. But The dog gave us another bow. It was all worth it to expand the walk. On a small island in the north, I hear there's a super rich guy. There is. Funnily enough, his name is Rich. Say, were you always rich? No, my parents just named me that, and it was coincidental that that's what I became. Hey, we talked to you. You, 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 let me talk to you. Jean is something. I don't think Louis could have accomplished this. I mean, yeah, no. But on the night, I don't know what you're talking about. Uh, what? He's supposedly a generous man with an interest in the arts. If only we had some art. Oh, wait. Yeah, but we can't get there. We have no way to travel to, to Britain at the moment. You wish to speak to Mother. She may be hard to understand. I mean, she was easy to understand before. Since, you know, 
just because she's talking about horrible murders the king did and the lady's like, oh, I just don't understand what she's saying. And she's like, oh, the king, why'd he murder all those people? Like, no, she's pretty easy to understand. You're just ignoring what she says. It's a different. I see. Finally free. That's good. I mean, like, okay, maybe she... That part I could see being confusing if she didn't know about the Storkholm and all the stuff that went there. We have more room. I got my own room. Yes, you did. Yes, you did. Uh... Louis is helping Jean now. He's not a lush anymore. Good for him. I just realized the town can go on even without the... You just realized that? Hey, look at you cleaning up your life. Jean asked me to help him. It's busy but fun every day. He's a good guy. He just needed some purpose in his life. Well, hello. What do you think of the Reborn Loire? The real progress is still ahead of us. I have to keep studying. Economy, culture exchanges, civil facilities. There's so much to do. And that's why you vote for Jean. Yay. I uh, know there's still two more things we can get here. Gotta find them. Ah, ah. Princess l has been missing since then? Eh, maybe the king was killed by Princess L. That's a thought. I mean, it seems more likely that maybe Lady, Lady Fida killed him, but... Yeah. There we go. Smooth and refreshing taste. Relaxing, mellow, free feel. It's mellow and free. Your wine is free? I didn't say that. I said feel. Huh. I'm trying to make such a drink. Want to try a swig? Yes. I'm willing to drink this, but is it really good? Of course, the taste is guaranteed. Down it in a chug. That's not how you drink wine, but sure. But Oh, you don't find it delicious? That's odd. Is that why I'm supposed to down it in a chug? He's like, I know this tastes bad, so just once, whoop. Now you won't taste it. I'll try a new mix next time. Come sample it, okay? Oh. If we can set ourselves on fire for photography, we can taste a couple of uh, bad batches of wine. Mm. Come on, man. Ugh. There we go. Third time's the charm. Yummy! It was good? Great! So it was good! <laughs> this is made of grapes! You were a winery before. What were you making your wine out of? Like, even before Loire expanded, you were the winery. <laughs> I can sell this now. Here, take a bottle. Alright, now we have a bottle of wine. Okay, next. Uh, yeah, you. Madame Papillo. What is it? Whatever happens, we shall never work for the masses. <laughs> Says you, lady. The town's grown, but my life hasn't changed. It is very boring. <sighs> Maybe I'll quit the shop, too. Even after the king's death, Madame still keeps making expensive clothes. But nobody would buy clothes like that. The shop's gonna fold. I'm Merrily. I know. We talked before. You're a traveler, aren't you? Can I ask you a favor? Are you willing to listen? I'm all ears. What favor is that? I'm listening. Thanks. I have some clothes I made here. I sell it in another town. I want to test the appeal of my clothes. May I ask you that favor? Sure. I'll just take those clothes here, right? Really? Thank you. Please do take it. Park obtained fancy clothes. Spoiler alert, we're gonna find someone and give these clothes to them, and then Marilee gets to own the shop, and we, you know, kick out Madame Papillo. I told you she'd get hers. Now we just wait. Yeah, croissant guy's still here, though. Things, some things may change, but my love of croissants does not. I tried out for the speed eating contest. Volume I can handle, but the speed kills me. Also, the, like, the eating that much. It kills me because then I explode from eating too much. Pierre made something called a camera. I know, I have it. 
Why is it called a camera? I don't know. You can invent something and name it whatever you want, lady. Are you tripping over your words, even though you're only 18 minutes in water break? I read a wonderful travel journal written by a man named Hedden. Maybe I ought to go traveling too. Yes, maybe. Oh, you have photos from many places. Well, I have one photo and it's from here, but sure. May I see them? Sure. That, you don't have, you don't appear to have the needed photos. Please come again. Yeah, I know I don't. I She's like, you have a camera, show me. I'm like, it's just a picture of outside. She's like, oh, I've seen that already. I could have told you that. I'd like to run a furniture shop where I can shop cheaply. You should do that then. Stress name Mer- what? Did I click too fast or- No, okay, your dialogue's just broken. Stress name Merrily works at Madame Papilo's, but It's a shame she has to work for a not haughty woman like Madame Papilo. Y yeah, but are you having a stroke, lady? What- What's with your dialogue? Oh, you looked it up for the for the, uh, the camera meant chamber, but one of the first forms of photography was the camera obscura, so dark chamber. Uh, yes. Also, the the way that you know, actually, like I'll take time to explain the camera obscura. No, you can look that up. That'd just take a long time. I was thinking about starting a business here because many people move here. A real estate agent is needed. So yes, if you're interested in the camera obscura, look it up on Wikipedia because that would take a lot of time to explain. Um, yes, it is. They are very neat. I just don't want to spend that much time talking about it. Uh, okay, I think we have everything we need for now. We got the clothes, we got Matisse's painting, we got the wine, we got the camera. So I think that's everything that we needed to pick up. All right. And now we go back to Loire Castle, where they've turned it from a castle into a giant banquet hall. A new challenger. You have 60 seconds to eat as much as you can. Beware, there are dishes containing bad medicine. Ready? Start. <laughs> Okay. I guess bad medicine is just like... I, I don't remember. Like, I know, like, some of the things, if you eat them, like, they're really spicy and... <laughs> you eat fast, but 60 seconds? Yeah, it's, uh... I mean, but look at Arco. I, you know... It, it takes a lot of, uh... Metabolizing to... Yeah, there we go. Bad medicine is, I guess, just spice. Um, you know, it, it takes a lot to, to be the savior of the world. You gotta keep your caloric intake up. Do you have to, like, actually eat everything, or is it just a, a total? I don't know, whatever, we're, you know, we're doing our best. I mean, I guess it, it must not be eat everything, it must just be a, oh no, there's the bad medicine. Because I was going to be like, do you have to eat all of this stuff? Like, no, because otherwise they wouldn't warn you. Like, some of the stuff is bad. Don't eat those ones. Come on, let me eat that last one. 25 points. That seems good, right? You scored 25 points. Excellent. For commemoration, you may have the stone behind me. And then I had a little dainty after shoving bowls of apples and roasts into your mouth. Little dainty clear up. But we got a magic rock. That's the important part. Now we can continue on. Let's take a look around our next location. So, as I, I mentioned to chat earlier, but I'll mention again now that we're here, Litz. Litz is a reference to Lisbon. Um, and there's only really one person I can talk about specifically when we get to him. But we're not there yet, anyways. So let's just look around the town. We'll talk to you about him when we get there. Hospital. If there was better medicine, more lives could be saved. 
Dr. Emilio always despairs about that. Oh, I forgot about Dr. Emilio. I didn't look him up to see if he's a act reference to an actual doctor. Dr. Emilio also studies medicine for infectious diseases. Said he could save many people when it's made. Uh, maybe I'll look him up on the screen. Let's see. Fantastic doctor. He treats the poor like us for free. He sounds great. Dr. Emilio's friend is missing. The friend is... The friend is me choking. The friend is Columbus. Dr. Emilio is very worried. Yeah, not Columbus. I was saying there's one person to talk about. Yeah, but I specifically said I was going to talk about people that aren't named their actual name. Like, Columbus is a reference to Columbus. Okay, there we go. I talked about him. Our child caught a fever. Dr. Emilio is doing the best he can. Ugh, it's so hot. I feel awful. <laughs> you feel like I'd, you'd choke if you tried that in real life? I mean, I choked just trying to talk about the word Columbus, so, you know. I'm sure I could eat that much in 60 seconds, too. What is it? Are you sick? You appear totally healthy. Yeah, you can go back to treating people. Fine. I'm gonna do a quick search. Uh, medicine. Emilio. Emilio, yeah. The problem is there's too many just Emilios for me to look at this all on stream right now, so... So, without having looked at any of... Because I forgot about Dr. Emilio, so I didn't look him up. Um... He, maybe, is a reference to Emil von Bering. Um, yes, yeah, so it's like, he doesn't sound like he's from Lisbon. Like, yeah, but there's another person from Lisbon who's not from Lisbon either. He's from France, the other guy we have to talk about. So maybe Emilio is a reference to Emil von Bering, who was German physiologist, received the 1901 Nobel Prize in Physiology or Medicine, the first one awarded in the field for his discovery of diphtheria antitoxin, widely known as the savior of children. I don't know. Is it a reference? I don't, I, you know, I just looked that up on the, you know, we just whoop that quick. So I don't know if that's what it's a reference to, but it could be. Like, you know, Emilio, that's kind of like Emil. And as I said, just because like Emil is German and this is, you know, this has been like, that doesn't really matter. There's people that are like referenced from other places, so. I like making pots and objects like these. I was asked to make a decoration for the church. What should I do? It might be interesting if I make something with a rare mineral. But yeah, so with on the, the seat of my pants, just on the fly, I must say that Dr. Emilio is a reference to Emil von Bering, which, you know, medicine, known as the savior of children. Like, you know, it kind of fits with what we saw in this one minute research. Let's a specialty is fresh and tasty sardines. Like me, ugh. but Ark is just like more food to eat. Yeah, tasty. Eat a fish, eat a whole, just, you know, we're going Castlevania on this big. Look at this giant hunk of meat on a bone. And we're like, yes, that's how we restore health. The Belmonts would be proud of you, Ark. I've never seen you around. Where are you from? Ah, uh, the inside of the planet on the underside of the crust, and I w what? Underground? <laughs> oh, I've heard some tall tales, but... Uh, there was this guy who used to come and talk about his big dreams. His name was Columbus, said he was gonna search for a new continent. He went off to Spain to tell that tall tale. He hasn't come back. Hi. Hi. I escaped from Spain, the bordering country. It was horrible. A ghastly killing light flared from the castle. I managed to escape with my life, but my wife and child. What happened? But they also escaped. Oh, okay. Uh, we meet again. Maybe we're alike in our thinking. Listen, have you seen Loire's princess around? You see, after the king's death, the princess disappeared from Loire. I thought just maybe she eloped with you, Sonny. No, sorry, I haven't seen her roid. Ugh, roid. You want to eat? The best known delicacy here is grilled sardines. What do you think? You want to try it? I already did. What? Yeah, there's a big plate of them on the table. You just ate someone else's food? Y yes. Was I not supposed to? Eh. Okay, more merchant stuff. Sure. What do you did? Nothing new. Okay. How about you? Uh. Blah, 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 blah. 
Okay, so if we need, want to come back, we could buy the silver vest from him and not go back to Loire. I don't know, maybe I buy that. Like, yeah, I just got the ring mail, but it prevents poison and poison's pretty annoying. Have you heard about Spain? Uh, something about a killing light and fleeing. An evil spirit descended on the castle and doomed the country. Eh, I'm Ark. I'll fix it. Ooh, luck potion. Gulp, 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 gulp. Eat it up, yum. All right. There's this portrait of Sylvain Castle in Spain. It supposedly has precious jewels in the place of eyes. That rumor attracted many thieves to the castle. None have ever come back. <laughs> scary. I mean, I guess it's it, like, it, yes, that's scary, but also like the fact that like a killing light descended on the castle, a curse has afflicted the whole country. Like, Maybe you should think twice about, like, I should steal a couple of gems. Just the thought. Like, couple of gems, killing curse upon the whole country. Just weigh your options. That's what I'm saying. Hi. Kinds. What is it? There's no local industry here. At least one industry is needed. Without such, the progress of this village is not possible. It is zero percent. Eh, we'll fix it. Don't worry about it. I always think sardines are plentiful, but they rot quickly. I wonder if there's a way of preserving them for a long time. Hmm, I wonder. Boy, you know the Quattros? They're nomads who live in camps. They dance, they sing, trade with the locals to earn money, I hear. Okay. What about them? I don't know, I just, I just wondered if you knew about them. Hello, church. Well, okay. I was gonna comment, you know, I commented on this before when we were in Neo Tokyo with the sake. And then I was about to comment on the winery and then I didn't, but now I'm gonna comment again. Like, I guess it's true. Because before when I started this game, I'm like, yeah, the beginning with like resurrecting everything is kind of has some religious overtone. But like, they could, you know, cut a couple lines. It's like, why did it never get released in America? Why was it only like Japan and Europe? But then you have stuff like, the winery where you're like you're drinking wine as yet like you're no they're not like you are of eight they're just like hey you boy do you want to drink some wine and you're like yeah and you just chug chug an alcohol and they don't have to be like would you like to try some delicious milk we'd like to perfect our apple juice recipe so like yeah they'd have to do more editing with that if it came out from nintendo of america back then and then you get to stuff like the church where it's like okay there's a cross yeah, I guess you could change that. And there's just a straight up depiction of the crucifixion. And like Nintendo of America would have had conniptions if they had to edit all this. So I guess that's why it never came out in America. People are all the children of God. We are all equals in the eyes of God. Let us pray. Amen. Hey, did you know that if you were in America, you'd be saying something else? What? God's compassionate. He always looks upon us the weak. Okay, and my sister's in the hospital sick. Pray for her to get better every day. And it makes sense. You're, you're, you know, you're in Lisbon. Yeah, I, I don't know if you've heard, but there has been a little bit of uh, history with the church and Europe. Just, you know, just in case you've never heard of anything about it. So it makes sense that, you know, they put that in Lisbon. Um, all right. I guess we're done here. Well. Thanks, Lisbon. It was nice knowing you, but now it's time to go this way. I could go to where I'm supposed to, but I really don't want to. We're going to do everything else we can first. Big Hall makes me happy. Big Hall makes my day. I'm just singing fisherman, hoping you will go away. Hey. We're trying to work. Stop talking to us. You want to go to another continent? That's impossible! We don't have the navigation skills. In the past, there was a Spanish ship that set sail looking for new continents. If they succeed, it could open the way for sailing to new continents. Stop saying new continents. How many times can you fit the word new and continent in the same sentence? Okay, nothing there. 
So you can just enjoy the nice song of the port. Which is also something kind of funny that, like, Litz has the same music as Loire. Like, because it's very French. Not the accordion. Da -da 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 da 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 and then you get to Litz and you're like, oh, so we're going to get, like, Portuguese music? No. Same song as Loire. All right, let's go to this little... Ah, the Quattro camp. Hello. I'm the head of the Quattros. I'm Quattro. Or, your name seems very, uh, very descriptive. This is an oasis for soothing the souls of weary travelers. Relax. So, yeah, they're just kind of a reference to the Romani. Just not none in particular, just sort of as a generic, you know, kind of like the nomads, just just a reference to, to peoples in general. The quattros appear randomly anywhere. We travel where the wind blows us, except the difference being that the Romani is like definitely like a European thing where in like these the quattros specifically will go to like the Americas and stuff. So they are they're a very traveling nomad. group. We're happy just to party every day. You only live once. Hi. I dance every day. I get sore all over. How about a massage? Sure. Where? Great. My back. Press firmly. And then you just... Eh. Eh. Shove. Good. Thanks. I feel much better. Here's a tip. One gem. But it is kind of funny. That they're like, I need a back rub. And you can give her a back rub. And she gives you a tip. Like, yeah, it's not a good way to earn money, but... Hey, buddy, want to play? Yeah. Sure, what are we playing? Uh, well, on second thought, playing with a guy. I guess the implication is... Like, it's weird that there's two of them. Like, presumably that like, they're playing strip poker? Like, I think that's what they're getting at, because, like, uh, playing with a guy. But the other person you're playing with is also already... A I don't know. I have no answers, only questions. Let's talk to you. The man who came here a bit back was very conceited, but then he told me about his trying to avenge a friend. Okay. Can you tell me more about this man? No. Uh. Fine. Well, if you're not going to tell us more about your friend, then it's time we leave Portugal and head to Spain and go to... Before we get into there, I just want to say, like, games often have a, a, a part or a, an enemy or a boss or something where you're like, oh, it's that level. Oh, it's that boss. Here is the part of this game where it's, oh, it's that boss. Sylvain's Castle boss is known to many and is, is rightfully feared. It, it's not a good time. But we're arcs, so we gotta do it. <sighs> Sylvain Castle. Here we come. Some things may change, but my love of croissants does not. 